Hello everyone. This is double elimination for four teams or four number of entries. In four teams or four number of entries, we have six games. And since four is included in the power of twos, meaning it has no buy. Remember that in writing the number of teams, it must be written vertically downward. So in four teams, all of the competitors will be playing in the first round. Now, let's proceed to diagram and game schedule. Since we have no buy in four teams or four number of entries, all of them will be playing in the first round. From the top, and then the game number, game one, game two, and let us have the uh, result. Winner one from game one, winner two from game two. Then let them play. And this will be game 3. So let us have the result. Winner 3. Since we have reached the second round, this will be the first round. Second round. We can now proceed to loser's bracket. Because this is the winner's bracket. And the other side is the loser's bracket. Now, let's proceed to loser's bracket. Let's focus on game one. So, this will be loser one. In game two, Loser 2 Now let them play In game 4 So let us have the result Winner Winner 4 Now let's go back to the winner's bracket in winner's bracket, we have already placed the loser 1 in the loser's bracket and placed the loser 2 in the loser's bracket. Then, we have another concern, the loser 3. Now, we will place the loser 3 in loser's bracket. This will be loser 3 in game in game 5. Now let us have the uh, result. Winner winner 5. Now don't forget to don't forget to identify the loser 3 where it came from. So meaning you have to write the broken line from game 3 will be placed in game 5 as loser 3 now we have only one game remaining because we have now we are now on 5 
games or pip game. Let winner 5 play with winner 3. In game, in game 6. Winner 5. Now, remember that if if winner 5 wins in game 6 meaning winner 3 and winner 5 has the same number of clues. Winner 3 has 1 and winner 5 has 1 meaning we need to break the tie to identify the champion to determine the champion so that do not forget to write your note below the diagram that if winner 5 wins wins game 6 there there shall be there shall be playoff and then let us have the result champion now, let's proceed to game schedule. Since we have six games, now let's interpret the diagram. In game one, we have one versus two. One versus two. In game two, we have 3 versus 4. 3 versus 4. In game 3, we have winner 1 versus winner 2. Winner 1 versus winner 2. In game 4, we have loser 1 versus loser 2. Loser 1 versus loser 2. In game 5, we have winner, one, winner 4 versus loser 3. Winner 4 versus loser 3. In game 6, in game 6, we have winner 3 versus winner 5. Winner 3 versus winner 5. And then the winner in game 6 will be the champion. Or the winner in the playoff to break the tie will be the champion this is the diagram in game schedule for four teams or four number of entries in double elimination